Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. So if you are using a MacBook Pro with M1 chip, and if your MacBook Pro has been taken a junk file such as cache and cookies and other relevant things, then your MacBook Pro can get slow, hang or can be even unresponsive. Therefore, cleaning those junk files such as cache and cookie will make your MacBook Pro faster than ever before. Now, let me just go ahead and quickly show you how you can do it on your MacBook Pro. Now to do this, the first things you need to do, just go ahead and click on this go option on top of your screen and then scroll down here and choose your computer. Click on there and then it's going to come right here with another pop-up window. Now once you're here, go ahead and choose Macintosh HD and here choose your library and now if you come here, you're going to see this folder called caches. Go ahead and click on there and in this caches folder, whatever the folder or files that you're going to see, simply select them all and just just go ahead and stake them to your bean, okay? Go ahead and enter your password for your MacBook. Now go ahead and click OK. Now please keep that in mind that some item will not be deleted because of the permission. Now just go ahead and click OK. Well, once you have removed all of this file from your caches, now all you want to do is just come back here and some scroll down to find another folder called Startup. Now go ahead and scroll down here to this folder called Startup Items. Go ahead and just click on there. And now, as you guys can see, there is no file stored, especially for our MacBook. But if you see any file stored or any folder is stored in here, now just go ahead and delete this file to make your MacBook faster than ever before. Now once you've deleted all of your files, and cache and cookies from your startup items, then you are good to go. Now, please be our fun things. Try not to delete this folder, especially the startup items and your cache folder, because these folders are actually important. But whatever the files you're going to get inside of this folder, you can delete them. Because if you delete this caches folder or the startup items, that can run some troubles. Now, let's go ahead and take a look at another ways to delete your cache and cookies on your MacBook Pro. Now, this this time, all you want to do is just go ahead and just close this window and then just click on your Go folder and now just go ahead and click Option Keys and then you're going to see this library option will appear and if I leave it up and if you press it again, you're going to see it right here Now click on there. Now once again, now from here, if you now just go ahead and open up the same folder here, then you're going to see more folder and more files. They're actually been hidden in right there. Now, let me just go ahead and come back here and show you once again. And here, if I just go ahead and open up the caches and here, as you guys can see, a lot of folder in here, you just go ahead and select them all and then simply drag them to your bin okay now let me just go ahead and just take it right there there you go now after deleting all of your cache and cookies and also the junk file from your macbook pro with m1 chip and then the next thing you just want to go ahead and do is to remove everything from your bin because once you've deleted them everything will be stored in here okay now if you want to get rid of them completely come down here and simply just go ahead and just use your two finger tap on there on your bin and then you're going to see this option called empty bin go ahead and click on there and everything is going to be deleted after you hit empty bin from this pop-up Alright guys, so this is how simple it is to remove your junk file, cache and cookies from your MacBook Pro with M1 chip and this is how you can do it. Hope you find this video useful, if so be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again.